This is a short one. It's 11 something at night. I'm still a little awake, but we've done a lot of work today. And a lot of it was just connecting with family in a very honest and intimate way that in the past I wasn't able to do. I would avoid it and have my preconceived notions of people and their behavior and probably either drank too much or ate too much. Today, because of the ayahuasca that I did a couple weeks back, I was able to open up and tell my story and um, connect. And that, that was huge. And besides connecting with my family and helping everyone start to understand that they have trauma to work through. I did a lot of work on myself this morning. Processed some stuff through meditation and mushrooms. I listened to classical music all day. It was so calming, so peaceful. And sat here and connected with my roommate as well. Let them open up, help them talk and process things, and play the game for, I don't know, 20 minutes. But you know, they say you want to do three things to really call it a successful day, right? Like a physical, a mental or emotional, and then spiritual. And I think sometimes we can do so much work in one category. It can not supersede the others, but there's only so much time in a day, right? So if I don't do it, a ton of emotional work, like connecting with my family and helping them, then I'm just not going to have time for exercise. That's so okay. We'll get plenty tomorrow, plenty the next day, etc., etc., etc. And I did a lot of spiritual work too, a lot of connecting, my intuition. Would I have liked to have worked out? Yeah. Would I like to have gone to jujitsu? Sure. Not 7 o'clock at night on a Sunday. That I don't understand. Someone offered up that training time for me. I was like, yeah, yeah. On a Sunday? Yeah. Sure, I'll be there. <sighs> could have went to the gym this morning and then went. Probably could have. But... Did I really want to? Did I find more joy in being here, drinking coffee, and taking my time? Yeah. So just know that as long as you don't go too long without getting on top of the other things, it's okay to do a lot of work in one or two of those categories and let the other one be. But if you don't take care of your physical body, you can't do the other two. You don't work on your emotional and you're just always in your physical or in your mental. Well, guess what? It's going to wreak havoc on both. And if you never connect to your spirit, well, you're a zombie. That being said, do the work. Forgive yourself for missing a day in one of the categories. It's okay. But just double down on the other ones. I'm going to go watch spooky show and then read a book yeah good night go bats